What's up guys, it's Lou from Unbox Therapy and I'm going to show you real quick how to do a restore, a factory fresh restore on your 2011 MacBook Air. The first thing you got to do is shut down the system, obviously pretty self-explanatory and the reason I'm showing you this video is because this one is a little different to do than previous models. There are no restore discs and there's no restore USB so you kind of need to know what you're doing. The first trick is the power plus option key trick. You got to hold both of them down at the same time. Um, after you've hit the power button, you can see the machine booting up. You can let go of power, but keep holding option. And uh, once you've done that, you'll see two options. Amazing. The option key gives us options. What a surprise. You've got the Macintosh hard drive on the left, and then you've got something called Recovery HD on the right. That's the important part. You want to select it, click enter, and it'll boot into this special recovery partition that's hidden on the SSD. Very cool. Um, what you can do from here is a number of things. You can either wipe your system out clean, completely delete everything, or you can restore from a time machine backup, or you can access disk utility, number of things. So the first thing, if you want to wipe it clean, is to open up disk utility and erase your hard drive. Obviously, that's very important. So you want to select Macintosh HD. That's where everything you've got is stored. That'll present you with a number of options across the top. The one that's important for this particular scenario is the erase option. That's how you're going to wipe it out, of course. There are two buttons down here, and uh, you select erase, and then you've got to confirm it because after that, it all happens very fast. If you you don't want to do this by accident, you know, if you've got some stuff on there that you're trying to protect, now you really want to make sure that you want to erase it. From there, you've got to reinstall an OS. The, the disk is clean at that point, so you want to select Reinstall OS. And this is obviously an OS X Lion system. Now, I sort of thought that maybe it stored the entire OS on that hidden partition, but I was wrong. In fact, it's got to go and get the components from the Mac App Store. So you spend a lot of time sort of retrieving those components from the web, even more so than installing it. So that's a bit of a headache. But you want to select your Macintosh HD, the same one that you wiped out as your install destination, of course. And then it'll go reach out to Apple's server and uh, servers. I'm sure they don't have one. <laughs> and uh, start to grab those components necessary for the installation of Lion. There's obviously some kind of authentication process making sure that they're going to give you the right set of components for your system. Uh, after that's all completed, you get a system reboot, and then it begins to install. This takes about half an hour, so it's about 45 minutes for the download, and then about half an hour for the install. So not you, you got to set aside a little bit of time. So you get a little check mark after that part has completed, and an automatic reboot, which will bring you back to factory fresh. You will boot right back up as if you just pulled this thing out of the box. So anyway, guys, the reason for this was just to illustrate the steps involved in, in restoring your system, of course. And since it's unlike any of the MacBooks before it, I thought it would be, um, you know, worth doing a video about. I also think you're probably going to see this kind of restore system in other MacBooks and maybe the entire Apple line at some point. So it's good to familiarize yourself with this particular process. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this content, hopefully you can like and favorite this video as it does help me out a bunch. And if you haven't checked out my new channel yet, it is called The Beast Feed. I'll put a link in front of your face as well as down in the description. You might like what's going on over there, so come pay us a visit. Subscribe if you like it. Otherwise, I want to thank you for watching. You guys make this content possible. And until next time, I will see you around the channel. All right, later, guys.